And again I welcome you friends on my Hungry Man channel. Today, an unusual pizza in the form of such an interesting roll, in which we have sausage, smoked meat, cheese, tomatoes, pickled cucumber. We smeared all this with ketchup, used puff pastry and that's the beauty we got. Let's try and go through our video recipe with you. Pizza guys just turned out really, really well. Your health. Let's start our video recipe. To begin with, we take puff pastry, which can be bought at any store. In this case, I had a puff pastry of 800 grams, which I defrosted and began to cut into ribbons about about 10 centimeters, pouring flour and rolling it out with his rolling pin so that it became a little thinner, since the sheet, you know, puff pastry, it is thick. I rolled it out with a rolling pin so that it became thinner and more elastic for our further cooking of our pizza. One piece didn't work out, yes, but we rolled it out anyway. Then we take a sausage, in this case we had a boiled sausage, which I cut into two halves and began to cut into such small half rings. I also cut hard cheese, cut tomatoes into half rings, cut green pickled cucumber into neat rings, so these are our ingredients. Then smeared with ketchup, lubricate our sheets, our strips of dough. With such a rubber spatula, I distribute it evenly throughout the sheet and then we start laying our sausage on one side to begin with, then we put tomatoes, cheese, pickle on the sausage and carefully wrap it like an envelope and then we roll up our mini roll. Here's a mini roll we get for pizza. Then we do it again with the next envelope, that's how we wrap it, also carefully hold it with our hands, since the dough has already thawed well, it is already beginning to take the shape that we give it. That's how we carefully fold it again with an envelope. Yes, you know, I took literally 350 grams of sausage, but I didn't have enough of it and had to cut the smoked brisket. Also look, I cut the smoked brisket into such beautiful rectangles, cubes and spread the smoked meat again, on top of a tomato, cucumber and hard cheese. That's how beautiful it turns out. Then our envelope is again folded, the other half is covered with our contents and neatly, neatly rolled into a roll. That's such a beauty. Then we spread them on parchment paper, Take an egg and begin to lubricate our surface with an egg so that it gives us a beautiful yellow baked crust. Then we start decorating it all with sesame seeds. We take sesame seeds and carefully spoon them on top so that our pizza gets such a piquant taste that sesame gives us, and accordingly, of course, such beauty. Then we preheat the oven to 180 degrees and send it for about half an hour, we send our pizza to bake for about 40 minutes. That's such a beauty. That's the kind of beauty we got. In some places, of course, the cheese flowed, but nothing, it turned out very tasty. I recommend everyone to try it. Bon appetit to everyone and see you soon.